Welcome back to my channel, Kentucky Fried Fun, and welcome if you're new. Tonight, I'm going to be doing an after dark kitchen clean with me. It is Tuesday, we had tacos for Taco Tuesday. There's not too much to clean up, but I wanna go ahead and make sure I get it done before we head outside to do our bonfire, because for me, the number one thing to keeping my house clean is doing my nighttime kitchen cleaning routine. So, let's get started. Like I said, there's not too much to do. Basically, put away the food, the dishes. Over here, we have some dishes to clean. Here's our basket of some more supplies. We just built a uh, bonfire pit this past weekend, and so I got us all set up and ready. But I just want to do the dishes. I need to wipe off this just a little bit. It's not too bad from browning the ground turkey and then just wiping off the countertops and the table. And then I'm probably gonna do a quick sweep or vacuum of the floor. So let's get started. The first thing that I did was just start by clearing away the table, first putting the food away so that can be in the fridge and kept nice, and then the dishes. Before I get any further into this video, I wanted to let y'all know that this is a collab with my good friend Stephanie. She will be doing a clean with me. I'll be sure to leave a link to both her video as well as her channel, Stephanie Goodman, up in the cards as well as down in the description box so that after you're finished watching my video, you can head on over to her channel for more cleaning motivation. You will also find she does a lot of junk journaling. She loves to craft. She has two adorable little dogs she loves to clean like me and she's just so much fun to watch I just love her had finished putting away the food and the dishes I wanted to go ahead and wipe off the table and to do so I'm just going to be using my Mrs. Myers all-purpose spray in the lemon verbena scent. So apparently I hadn't actually put the food away yet, I had just cleared away the table, but here I'm doing that now. And then I also will be showing y'all a little treat that Michael brought home from work that day. They are chocolate covered raisins, you can see them sitting there. Lately he has been bringing home a little treat every now and then. His work is since there's not as many people and they don't want the treats and snacks to go bad, they've basically been giving them away free, so that's awesome. Once I was sure all the food was put away, I began clearing the island. Here I'm just dumping the ice and water into that cup because I don't like to waste, so I'm just going to make a drink of it myself. Time for all the dishes. Since there's really no explanation needed for washing dishes, and I'm not honestly using any special dish soap this time. I normally use like my Mrs. Myers or Method, but I'm just using some generic, just trying to use that up. But I'm just gonna let the video play. I'm gonna put on some motivating music for y'all, and I hope that this is encouraging y'all to get your nighttime cleaning done.
now that all the dishes are done, it is time to do one of my favorite chores. I'm pretty sure I say this in every cleaning video, but that's just to scrub out the sink, get it nice and clean, and then give it a good rinse. Make it look nice and shiny. After the dishes, it is time to go around the kitchen and wipe down the countertops. I'm going to be using my same spray that I used on the table. I don't know why I'm showing y'all again, but here it is again. And if you didn't notice my little basket right there, it has our some more supplies. Like I mentioned, we did build a bonfire, but we didn't go out that night. We did go out the next night, and I posted pictures of it on Instagram. If you're not following me over on Instagram, I'll be sure to leave my handle here on the screen, as well as down in the cards down in the description box if you would like to follow me over there. I try and share more on a daily, if not every day, um, basis. Last but certainly not least, it is time to go ahead and give the floor a good vacuum. I don't always vacuum at night. Sometimes I do sweep, just depending on if we have an Airbnb guest or not. We do currently, but he's been with us since January and he's a college student, so I didn't think he'd mind me vacuuming the floor at 6 p.m. at night. <laughs> so I just go ahead and give the floor a good vacuum. y'all so much for watching this video I hope that you enjoyed it and that it gave you some cleaning motivation also be sure to go ahead and check out Stephanie's channel I'll again be leaving her channel and her video linked up in the cards as well as down in the description box if you did like my video go ahead and give it a big thumbs up if you are new to my channel perhaps you're coming over from Stephanie's I would love it if you would stay around and subscribe and be sure to click that little bell so that you don't miss out on any more of my videos. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a blessed day and I will see y'all later. Bye!